Each day, the City of Fargo Department of Solid Waste picks up about 100 tons of garbage from the curbsides of single-family homes and takes it to the city landfill. It is a big task, but the job is carried out quickly and efficiently using an automated, volume-based collection system. Each residential household is provided with a garbage cart, which can be picked up and dumped into a garbage truck using an automated arm. Enterprise Director Bruce Grubbs says the city chose to use the automated volume-based system after receiving requests from residents. We think that uh, it makes the level of service being provided and the compensation for that service equitable for everybody. Uh, it isn't a perfect system, but it does uh, move us quite a bit closer to a user fee-based system. In other words, you pay for the amount of service that you require. And uh, we think that uh, certainly from a fairness perspective, uh, this is the fairest approach that we could find. The automated system also helps enhance safety for city garbage collectors who pick up trash at an average of 350 homes a day. In the past, garbage collectors picked up the bags manually, in some cases, several bags at one home. You know, it's going to be a lot easier on the body. I mean, we're not going to be having to, to manually lift everything in the truck. And it's, it's just going to be easier all around. It's going to look cleaner for the city. Um, a lot less injuries are going to happen on the job. So, As residents, there are a few things you'll need to know before you take the trash to the curb. Each household is provided with a garbage cart free of charge, which must be used in order for automated trucks to pick them up. There are three sizes you may choose from and each has a different price. The small 48 gallon cart costs $6 a month. The medium 64 gallon cart is $9 a month. And the large 96 gallon costs $14 a month. A standard kitchen garbage bag is 13 gallons. So if you generate four of those or less each week, you'd want to choose the small cart. If you generate five or six bags a week, you would choose a medium cart and seven or more bags a week, you would need the large cart. The pricing structure that we set up now since the uh, average person in Fargo on a, on a weekly basis uh, puts out about 60 gallons of garbage, we've decided that falls in line with the medium-sized can. So they... You will need to contact the Solid Waste Division at 241-1449 to schedule special pickup for any extra items left outside of the cart. If you produce more garbage than fits in your cart on a regular basis, you are encouraged to reevaluate your cart size. It will likely save you money to move to a larger cart. If your cart gets damaged, the city will either repair it or issue a new one. It is your responsibility to keep your cart clean and in good condition. To clean the cart, Simply rinse it with a garden hose. When placing your cart on the boulevard, you'll need to pay close attention to the direction it's facing and what's around it in order for the automated arm to be able to reach it. Place the cart in your driveway or on your boulevard no more than two feet from the curb or end of the driveway. Make sure the arrow on the top of the receptacle is facing the street. You'll also need to keep your cart clear of any obstructions such as trees, mailboxes, signs, or fire hydrants. Please place your garbage on the boulevard by 8 a.m. on your regular garbage day. Details on hazardous waste, large items, and yard waste, as well as which day collection takes place in your neighborhood, can be found on our website, www.fargogarbage.com.